टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस फिटिंग ऑफ ए स्ट्राइट लाइन ओके सो हियर ही हैज गिवन द एक्स वैल्यूज एंड द करस्पॉन्डिंग वाई वैल्यूज ही हैज गिवन सो फॉर द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू वन द करस्पॉन्डिंग वाई वैल्यू इज फोर्टीन सिमिलरली फॉर टू इट इज ट्वेंटी सेवन एंड सो ऑन ओके सो फर्स्ट वॉट यू हैव टू डू द लेट द स्ट्राइट लाइन इक्वेशन बी लेट द इक्वेशन ऑफ द स्ट्राइट लाइन बी वाई जी इक्वल टू ए प्लस सम बी एक्स सो लेट द स्ट्राइट लाइन इक्वेशन बी वाई जी इक्वल टू ए प्लस बी एक्स ओके दिस इज द फर्स्ट पॉइंट सो इफ यू नो द वैल्यू ऑफ ए एंड द वैल्यू ऑफ बी द प्रॉब्लम इज ओवर सो हाउ टू सॉल्व द वैल्यूज ऑफ ए एंड बी यूजिंग द गिवन डेटा मीन्स यू हैव टू यूजिंग द नॉर्मल इक्वेशंस you have to solve the values of a and b what are that normal equations are sigma y g equal to n a plus b into sigma x sigma x y g equal to a sigma x plus b sigma x square if you solve these two equations you are going to get the values of a and b you substitute those two values in their straight line equation you are going to get the straight line okay so one then next step what you have to do is the third step you have to write the values you have to prepare a table so the table like looks like this so you write the values of x x value is 1 2 and 3 and 4 and 5 the values of x are this one similarly the values of y are 14 27 and 40 55 and 68 okay next to which column you have to frame so here you come across sigma y sigma y how will you get the sigma y if you add these entire values you are going to get the sigma y this column summation is nothing but the sigma y this column summation is nothing but the what sigma x sigma y you know sigma x you know okay sigma y n n is what n for this problem is here n is equal to here n is equal to 5 the number of items this is the 1 2 3 4 5 he has given the five values that's why n is equal to 5 next one is sigma x the sigma x summation of this column okay next sigma x y you have to find out the sigma x so how will you find out the sigma x y you multiply the first column value and the second value you will get the next one okay this uh, is nothing uh, this column summation gives the sigma x y okay next one here sigma x already it is there sigma x square next you frame a new column x square the summation of this column will gives the sigma x square so x square means x is 1 x square is 1 4 3 square is 9 4 square is 16 5 square is 25 okay if you add these uh, column values you are going to get as a 55 okay similarly x y x into y means this is a 14 2 into 27 is 54 okay 14 into 3 is 120 Okay, fifty-five into four, two hundred and twenty. Okay, two hundred and twenty. Sixty-eight into five, three hundred and forty. Three forty. So if you add this column value, so how much you are going to get is seven four eight. Seven four eight. So the uh, summation of the column Y is nothing but the two zero four. The summation of the X. column is nothing but the 15 15 okay next step what you have to do is the first you have assumed the straight line equation next to solve the values of a and b the normal equations you have written using this uh, data you have prepared the table this is the third step next fourth step the value of n is equal to 5 now you substitute the values table values in the normal equations the sigma y this is the first equation this is the assume it as the second equation so 
so sigma y is equal to how much 204 204 is equal to n n is equal to 5 a means a only sigma x is how much 15 15 b okay this is the uh, equation 3 similarly sigma x y sigma x y how much 748 748 is equal to a into sigma x that is nothing but a into sigma x 15 a a into sigma x 15 times of a plus b sigma x square that means 55 times of b 55 times of b this is the next equation we are going to get okay so now if you, if you solve these two equations if you solve these two equations you are going to get it uh, the values are a is equal to 0 you are going to get and b is equal to 13.6 you are going to get using the calc if you solve therefore the equation of the straight line is we have a plus b x therefore y is equal to a means 0 plus b means 13.6 into x therefore y is equal to 13.6 into x is the straight line equation for the given data ok so in this one main five steps first one is the straight line equation second one is the normal equation third one is the preparing the table fourth one is the preparing the equations using the table next fifth step is the solving the equations okay thank you